What is sciatica exactly? It's kind of like a broad term, generally speaking, that the sciatic nerve is aggravated. So there are a lot of things that can cause the sciatic nerve to be aggravated. And I always think it's so, so, so valuable to get in and work with a physical therapist to get to the root cause of your exact problem. And this is a little bit of a hot take. No, not to just so your doctor can document that you failed conservative treatment and you can do surgery. There are a lot of effective treatments for sciatica to really help get you out of pain. But what we're gonna do today is we're just gonna go over a couple of those exercises that are pretty effective in helping with that pain. So the first exercise is what we call like a nerve glide. So basically the sciatic nerve kind of runs down the back of your hip and down the back of your legs. And so basically what we're doing is we're kind of what they call flossing the nerve. So if you can visualize, there's like a rope that's going down the back side of your hip and down your leg. What we're doing is we're taking all the slack out of that rope by straightening your knee out and then pulling your toes up. And you're just kind of flossing it similar to like how you would visualize floss through your teeth and then back down. What this does is if the nerve is kind of impinged or there's any muscles that are kind of pressing on that nerve, the nerve should glide really nice inside of a sheath and you're just trying to get that nerve kind of freed up or gliding again back within that sheath and sometimes that will decrease the pain associated with any aggravation that could be occurring. So straightening the knee out, toes up towards your nose, relax, down, toes up, legs straight, toes up towards your nose, relax, and back down. 